this is Epic Storm Studios. I'll be showing you how to make an elevator in Hammer Editor today. So let's get started. You're gonna need to start off with a base, a button. Hold Alt, and you'll be able to freely move your mouse without it locking the grid. We need to choose our texture. We need to use Dev. Now I need another square inside of that. I need to convert that square to in, into a button. So it to entity. Choose funk button. Name it button. And then that's basically all you need. Now we need to make our elevator itself. You should have a thing up here where it'll move to. Right about there. Should be okay. Now that you have the base, you need to make a stick, yeah, that goes up to about here, and that'll be what actually moves our elevator. You need to make this the invis texture, so find V over in the corner. And then hit enter. And now that'll be in a little invisible stick sitting right there. Now I need to group them. Just select your pointer. Hold control. Click on your platform. And then hit control G. That'll group them up. Be selected as one entity. I may have made it a little too high. That can be adjusted easily. Now that we have adjusted our base of our elevator, now we need to actually turn it into an elevator. So hit two entity and make it a funk door and name it elevator. I don't care if it's spelled wrong. Move direction should be up. Then if you want it to uh, close or on force closed, you probably want that on yes. And you also want blocking damage. Uh, I'm just going to put mine through a whole bunch because blocking damage means it will get squished whenever you go underneath of it. Now I need to output the button. Go to outputs, put new or add. 
on pressed elevator you probably want toggle and hit apply now this thing is gonna go when you press that button but that's highly inconvenient to press that button run over here and go up so now you need a second button Now we need to convert this to a button also. Add another output on pressed elevator toggle apply. Now when you press that button, this will either up or come back down. And our elevator by default is set by default your uh, elevator is meant to move uh, whenever you touch it. So we need to change that by going into properties, flags, unclick touch opens and then click toggle hit apply and then you can export your map this can take a while alright now our map is compiled now that our map has been compiled we can now drop it into our Garry's mod folder or wherever else we like it congratulations you have successfully completed this tutorial on how to make a elevator and hammer editor have fun i'll be back with more awesome hammer editor tutorials soon enough